taken them to the cleaners. <laughs> uh, it's extraordinary. It really is. 850 million wiped off their share price. And it just goes to show that old sort of adage, go woke, go broke, mm. you know. And when will these organisations learn that they should need to steer clear of all of this kind of stuff? Why are they getting themselves involved in all of this? Um, and <laughs> they're, they're learning their lesson the hard way. And hopefully other organisations that have got these woke board members, they're basically activist board members who've inst installed themselves on these boards who are then trying to push an agenda yeah. and you've got to think why are they doing it other yeah, than just why? to make themselves feel good and yeah. to talk about it at dinner parties but they need to sit up and they need to listen to what's happening because you know 850 million wiped off your company's share price is awful. Yeah I, I mean and uh, the, the chairman of NatWest, mm. uh, Sir Howard Davis, yeah. uh, you know right at the heart of the Remainer establishment yeah. Yeah. And apparently he's like a really obsessive Remainer. <laughs> uh, he gets £750 million pounds yeah. a 